So I'm here with Raphael from DMG Mori at the front and open house. Raphael, this is about the sell-offs, or this feature is about the sell-offs control. Two things I want to ask you. Firstly, explain to those that have never heard of it before what it is. And then secondly, some of the updates that have happened recently. Yeah, so with Silos X, we are presenting our new uh, platform, our software platform for all DMG Mori machines. They uh, can be used on mills, on lace, any type of machine. And additionally, we have our traditional controls like the Siemens i9 or the MAPS based on Fanuc or Mitsubishi. What's the difference between the Siemens control and the Celos? Do they sit separately, work together? How does it work? Now they work together. So the Siemens control actually does all the movements, the programming of the machine. And the Celos is the supporting uh, software platform for um, job information, monitoring of the machine, anything around the machine, maintenance tasks, this can be done in Celos. And the actual programming and running the machine is done um, in the, yeah, the CNC control, which could be a Siemens or Hyde 9 or. We're doing here at the open house, or what you're presenting also, is almost like a dashboard, as if this was a factory. Can you perhaps show our audience that? Because it's quite fascinating. Yes, so what we can display here is called the DMG Mori Messenger. Uh, and we have connected all the machines on the shop floor, all on the exhibition here, and we can get live data in this system from all of the machines, so we can see if they are running, uh, if the feed rate is turned up, which program they are running, which tool is engaged. So we have total information, full transparency of the entire production. So it's essentially like, this is like your factory. Basically, yes. this sham is like... This is a, a digital twin, you can say, of the faction. And what is the advantage to having me? It's uh, very good to get a quick overview of your production to see what, which machines are running, which are not running. And also you can feed the data from this system into other systems so you can get information on which job is running on which machine. Um, the environment, eco modes, what are you doing using this system for that area and, and how does it work in conjunction? Yeah, it helps uh, the uh, operator uh, here with uh, features like energy saving. Uh, so it's like a standby mode for machine tools. So machine uh, runs the last program of the day and then goes into standby mode automatically and it dramatically reduces the energy consumption of the machine tool. And then with our feature wake up and warm up, we can even power up the machine before the start of the shift automatically. It supports all across the range. DX, a digital transformation, supports you all across the entire MX and GX transformation. Okay, now uh, what is new with this particular uh, highlight that you're talking about here at the Open House? So the Celos X, which is the new version of our software platform, uh, it's first time there's uh, online update capabilities and cloud connection functionality. So this is the big step that we are doing from the previous version to the next level. As well. And what's the biggest advantage to that, to being able to use the cloud? Is it the fact you just don't have to have such a big memory to store things? It improves performance maybe as well on the control system? Yeah. Basically, it reduces the maintenance efforts on the customer side. He doesn't need to run a server. He doesn't need a very big IT infrastructure and people to support it. Everything is done by ourselves and our colleagues at Microsoft. So we run the cloud and the customer just signs in like you do on your iPhone with the iCloud, for example. And is there anything else that's grabbing people's attention here? or well, they should be uh, watching. So what is grabbing people's attention also on our new control panel, the Ergoline X, is this uh, new smart ride feature. So we have combined the feed and the rapid in one single operation unit, which vibrates at zero and 100%. So the operator can look into the working envelope while operating. It doesn't have to do this all the time. The machine does it automatically. We have something called a conditional stop. So it stops before a tool call, before a swivel plane, or transition from G1 to G0 automatically. So no need to run single block for new programs. You can run an automatic with this feature and it's even more safe than uh, before. Okay, anything else? Technology yeah. cycles, maybe this is something a big yes. always talk about. Technology cycles, what we are showcasing as well with the Cinomeric One is our new 3D shop floor programming. It's a feature based on machine programming with you import a 3D model, a step file, for example, and then it detects if there is a, a pocket to machine, it detects that automatically. You only select spindle speed, tool and feed. Everything else is done automatically. So your machine tools are developing. 
but this side is developing equally as quick, is it? Yeah. Because this is what's the real game changer nowadays. It's automation and digitization. 